so hey guys welcome back again to a new video and in this video we are just going to solve a blown hub machine that name is Keoptrix level 1 this is actually level 1 Keoptrix okay so what is our challenge so Keoptrix VM image challenge says the Keoptrix VM image are easy challenges the object of the game is to acquire root access via any means possible except actually hacking the vm server or play on the purpose of these games are to learn the basic tools and technique in vulnerability assessment and exploitation there are many more ways than to want to successfully complete the challenge okay so this is our challenge description so how actually we can download this just click one of this link and your keyoptics will be downloaded as dot rare file okay <laughs> After downloading your cryptic locate it and then simply extract it after extracting open up this folder and here is a virtual box file and this is vmware file here we are going to use VMware so let's do that now open up your VMware workstation pro okay so from here we are just going to file and then open we have to locate our Keoptrix level 1 and here is our VMware file just open it okay so after opening we have to just click on edit virtual machine settings and we have to check everything is right or not so here is our memory 64 mb and this 3 gb and this is bridge automatic internet connection okay so but when we run our net discover command from kai linux our linux or kai linux will not able to discover the Keoptrix ip address so how actually you can fix that so first we have to see what the problem actually is so let's start this and if i power on this virtual machine okay just click on i copy it okay just be focused on the logs what actually is saying here everything is okay and here is the main problem bring you up the interface ethernet zero we will we will get the failed message and here it is determining the ip information for it zero failed okay so our vm just put successfully but we have failed to assign our ip address so after logging in in our kali linux machine we have to just get the root access okay so first we have to check out what is our kali ip address if i type i config we can see that actually our ip it is 192.168.23.33 and <coughs> every vmware machine if we just install it new then the ip range will be near of these 133 the ip value of the last digit of this value will be 133 the ip should be 192.168.23.134 or 131 okay but if we run our net discover sorry this is our ip address and this is actually our host ip address so 
this is not the our Kali Linux our Kali machine failed to obtain the IP address of our key optrix so if you try these one two three times you will not able to get the IP address of the key optrix because the bridge networking is not working on the firmware so how actually you can fix it to fix this issue we have to fast stop our this key optics vm machine so what we have to just we have to just power and then shut down guest and okay shut down okay so our key optics vm has been shut down let's back to this folder and here you can see that key optics level one vm or machine configuration we have to edit this file so we have to just open it with sublime text okay so here actually you can open this configuration file with any text editor so just we have to find ctrl f cancel we'll just find bridge and then if it's just find here is the ethernet.0.0 .0 name bridge change it to okay sorry BRIT bridge we have to change it with net and again if i just find all and there is nothing we don't have to edit all of this file we have to just edit here where is ethernet dot zero here we have to just edit that this 44 number line this ethernet dot zero network name net okay and that's it we are done Okay, after saving the configuration file, let's open that key optics PM machine again. So file open and then games new folder key optics level one and there is a VM configuration and then open it. Okay, now if we power on the virtual machine, there should be no error on it zero. And you can see that bringing up the interface is zero is okay. That means everything is okay. And now, if I go back to our terminal, if we run again our net discover command, we now our next discover command will avail to find the IP address of our key optics. And here it is. So if this IP address is actually key optics or not, we have to just copy selection and then type enum for linux and then press the ip address and just press enter and here it is looking up for status of 192.123.k of tricks okay that's it so our networking problem has been solved now it's our challenge is to innovate the machine and gather information what ports actually running on that VM machine and how actually we can get the root access from it.